I want to say is that if you may look at yourself in the mirror, don't call yourself ugly, stupid, or not good, because you're always beautiful, like the person that you are. And, you know, if nobody else loves you, love yourself, because, you know, God loves you. And you may be going through things, but just know you have you and your family and your friends and people who come in your life that help you out in everything you do. When I think about Ricky, Ricky's like a gentle giant. To me, when he speaks, it, he speaks from his heart. And that's what I feel when I talk to him. Um, there's no pretense, there's nothing. It's just, he's just a beautiful spirit. That's how I see him. I think that's what the kids must feel as well, because they're also very comfortable around him. He likes people. He, he's, he's a people person. He just, but his heart is as big as gold. Honestly, we do all have just unlimited amount of potential and power and energy within all of us. And that, you know, over time, I think our society, we kind of have a way of killing creativity and harnessing it and um, making people afraid to live life. My vision for the world is just to create something that hasn't existed before. That's my vision, is choice. Is, is fun isn't something we have to earn, it's, it's who we be. We just have to choose it. And kids are willing to choose it. Don't beat it out of them. Don't beat it out of them, encourage them, empower them. And, and for me, you know, it's, it's like when I first started the foundation, it was the idea that, okay, I'm famous, I'm supposed to be some kind of role model. And, I, and I've been looking for, what is that? What is that? And so, yeah, the kids can watch me on television and they can see that, that I was a famous football player and that I'm um, lending my name and my time to the program. But to be with the kids and, and Ricky's kids, the name of the program became so much more real because they know me.